So I'm here today with Michael Bruno from Honor Society. Hi, Michael. Hey, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. So can you tell us a little bit about what you're doing now? Uh, yeah, since um, the last nine months or so, I've sort of made a little bit of a career change into uh, becoming a side musician. I've spent most of my career being a frontman, um, but I've kind of segued into this cool niche kind of thing where I'm uh, kind of the go-to guitar player for a lot of different hip-hop acts. Oh, very cool. Yeah. Wow, that must be fun going from kind of like touring and being on a band with the Jonas Brothers and then, you know, going to like a whole different world with hip-hop, yeah? Yeah, it's, um, I've had the, I don't know, I don't even know, it's just been, um, my career's been very broad, very wide-ranging. Even in Honor Society, we did open for the Jonas Brothers, but we also opened for Timbaland on one of his tours, nice. so um, I've always sort of uh, been on both sides of the line of you know rock and pop and hip hop, so it's been really cool to sort of have both feet on the hip hop side for a little while. Got it. What yeah. was your most recent job? Uh, most recently, did some stuff for Pharrell, Pharrell Williams, which is pretty cool. That's been awesome. Yeah, um, obviously legendary producer, an amazing just creative person, and uh, we did the NBA All Star Game uh, down in New Orleans, and then we performed with him. Um, we meaning the whole his whole side band um, for uh, the Brit Awards in London. Very cool. Yeah, and then um, we weren't at the Oscars, but we did all the pre-recorded music for the Oscars. So everything you heard uh, while he was performing, all the guitar that was me. So uh, that was really exciting. So you can honestly say that you, Michael Bruno, have played the Oscars. Yes, <laughs> my guitar, <laughs> my playing has been on the Oscars. It's a huge, huge, uh, huge honor for me. It's pretty awesome. Thanks. And what's your favorite song in this moment? Like whether it's this week or this <laughs> two weeks, this month, what's your right now, that's, your song? That's funny because the entire drive here, um, I, was, I had one song on repeat. What was which it? Is, uh, <laughs> another rapper called, uh, his name's Schoolboy Q. Um, and I had the pleasure of uh, playing with him on Arsenio and Conan a few weeks ago. But um, his new single called Man of the Year, it's just like so infectious and so great. And kind of a little bit of a breath of fresh air with like some of the other hip hop that's out right now. So um, that's probably my song at the moment. And then there's another guy named Raleigh Ritchie. He's a little more of like an indie artist. Um, he's got a song called Bloodsport and it's just a really clever song about um, the uh, how love is a battle and all that kind of stuff. It's, so check check both of those out. Nice. Yeah. Uh, favorite singer or band? Favorite singer or band? Uh, singer, Prince, uh, band. It really flip-flops between the Rolling Stones and the Beatles. If I think like band, band, like it's probably the Stones, okay. probably the Rolling Stones, but greatest musical artist ever is the Beatles. It's just no, no argument. No contest. Yeah, no contest. What's your favorite Honor Society song? Favorite honor size. I think our I think our best song, meaning it was the perfect storm of like the right song with the right producer, you know, all that kind of stuff, is a song called Hurricane, which um, you can find online on iTunes or Spotify or all that stuff. Um, but my most personal favorite song is a song called Two Rebels, which was on our uh, major label debut album. Um, so Two Rebels, you can also find out there. Uh, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Awesome. We're so excited to see what you do next. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thanks for having me. Thanks, Michael. Sure.